Today is April 18, 2021, and we're still in April, and I'm able to eat some beautiful pak choy I have here. I'm just gonna harvest two today. I still have some more over here that can get a little bigger. And I have some more on the other side that I'm still waiting for. But here I, I have, and they're medium size. So this is the right um, height that we're looking for, size. And also, I do have radishes. So it's still April. It's not even the end of April, second week of April. And we're able to harvest from the greenhouse lovely radishes even right here i could have harvested them maybe a couple days ago i i do have some more that i'm still waiting for let me see i think i could take some more so i still have some more lovely one here so that's what it is my friends it's just april just the middle of april and we are able to harvest and the and the, the crops that i have in the greenhouse here i did kick start the growing season really early because it's my first time growing in my greenhouse and i wanted to see how early can i start growing and really i have everything documented to see next year how early i can start certain crops yes i did go ahead and start some crops way too early but i have some here and for today after three weeks of growing inside, I have transplanted them. I am able to harvest from three three weeks of planting. So, that's what's going on here in the greenhouse. In this garden bed here, I do have a lot going on. I have more pop choy here. I have four, what, five. I do have spinach that I'm waiting. I'll be harvesting the leaves from here. I have marigold flowers. I have more flowers here. And I have cabbage. I have a variety of broccoli, cabbage, kale. And it continues all the way over here. So the growing continues all the way over here. I do have um, romaine lettuce that I can start harvesting the leaves if I want to. I have a other lettuce that here that I'm going to be just harvesting the leaf. I do have kale, as I said, broccoli and cabbage. And I have some garlic that I planted back in the fall. So they're here coming up. I have squash at the back and I do have a beautiful zinnia flowers so everything going on here and as i said it's the 2021 growing season and i just want to show you that you if you have the space and the time you too can be harvesting early i have beets i have more pak choy seedlings There I do have turnip, spinach, I have some flowers, like right here I do have flowers. I have turnip here that I will be transplanting within today or tomorrow, a couple of days. I have more 
on the far end right here I do have some more I just harvested them radishes I do have more radishes here and I have some spinach coming along and these I want to take these outside so I'm still waiting for them to get a little bigger for me to take them outside at the back here I have tomatoes lots and lots of variety of tomatoes I have about this year I'm growing about five or I want to say six varieties of tomatoes so that's what I have here and even over here I do have more tomatoes growing over here these are some flowers I did start my flowers back in February and still they need transplants and I'm see I'm holding out to see if the weather is gonna get better and how if they'll survive keeping in here I do have more flowers in this container here I have a tray of kale, cabbage, cauliflower, and broccoli all going on right here. Over here, I have pepper seedlings, and I do have more cabbages and stuff going on. I have cucumbers also. So I have a lot of stuff going on right here. Here, I have rue tabagea swede, another name for that. I have going where I'll be transplanting. I have sunflower seedlings and more zinnias in the back right here that I will be transplanting into bigger pots. Here I transplanted some pea, some beans, cucumbers, flowers. I even have corn transplant right here going on thanks for watching guys and if you haven't already subscribed to the channel please subscribe as we journey along growing food for the 2021 growing season i do have more stuff more surprises going on that i'll as we go along in the 2021 growing season i'll get you in on it and let you see what else we have to grow this year so that's it for today. All the best.